In this Divi quick tip, I'm gonna show you how to trigger page element animations on both the up and down scrolls. Whereas by default, they only trigger on the down scroll. Why would you wanna do this? Well, I don't know exactly, probably because animations are cool and this is basically getting twice the amount of animations. The important thing is that this was a Divi quick tip request that I received via YouTube comment by commenter Ask For More, whose name is pretty apt. So hey, Ask For More, this one's for you. Just to make sure everyone knows what I'm talking about when I say we're going to be making uh, the page element animations trigger on the up and down scroll, here's an example of our end result. I'm going to refresh this about page and you'll see that all the elements that animate, they animate as they come into view on the down scroll. Now typically, this would only happen on the down scroll and when we would go back up, there would be no animations because they would stay set in the final position. However, we're going to use a jQuery script to trigger the animations as they come into view, regardless of whether it's on the up or down scroll, so that when you scroll back up, like I'm getting ready to do, you'll see all those animations over again. To achieve the same effect on your Divi website, you'll need to copy the script that we've provided in the accompanying blog post. Uh, YouTube viewers can check the video description for this link and everyone else can simply go to elegantthemes.com slash blog and search for the blog post for Divi Nation episode 14. It's in the community category. Once you've copied the script, navigate to your WP admin and go to Divi theme options integrations. You're going to want to copy the script we provided into the section called add code to the body. Once that's done, click save and you should now be able to go back to the front of your site and experience a lot more animation fun. All right. Well, that's all for this Divi quick tip. If you have a quick tip request, you can leave it in the comments section, wherever you're listening to or viewing this. You can also send your request to me at podcast at elegant themes.com with the subject line Divi quick tip request. Thanks for tuning in and see you next time. Don't forget, if you're watching this video on YouTube or Facebook, take a moment to subscribe, follow, like, and or share. <laughs>